A lot of people don't know this about me, but I actually do not live with my parents every single day of the year. No, in fact, for about half the week, I am living right here in my apartment, about an hour away from my parents. So I'm not even near them. I just film and annoy them half the week so I get enough content throughout the week. Pretty smart, right? Anyways, I've lived here for about the last two years with my roommate and he is getting a little sick of me. I think, he never actually said that explicitly. He said, when are you moving out? I don't know what that's supposed to mean though. Today is the last day of my lease and instead of renewing my lease for another year, I'm gonna move back in with my parents. Yes, I am 24 years old and I'm going back to live with my mama and dada. Dad, that was weird, that was strange, I shouldn't say that. The best part about this all is that they have no clue, zero clue that I'm coming back. I didn't tell them that I'm moving out, I didn't tell them that I'm moving back in, I didn't tell them what to expect. Anyways, today I'm gonna see how long it takes them to realize that I'm moving back in with them. I'm not gonna tell them, I'm just gonna see how long it takes for them to figure it out. I will say I'm gonna miss this view quite a bit. Not really a view right now, but usually it's very nice. Yeah, there's wildfires in Ontario right now where I live, so uh, it's got a little smoky. <laughs> really bad on the throat. It's like you keep throwing the whole And this is my room. I've already taken a ton of things back. So all I have left to do, oh, I'm dizzy from doing that turn. I'm really happy there's no pee stain on the bed. That would have been awkward. Today, I just need to disassemble all of the big things like my bed, my dresser, my desk, and bring those back to my parents' house. I have to find a place to put them because I don't want to make it obvious that I'm moving back in. It's a secret, it's a surprise. They're gonna love it. Got it. Can someone open the door? Someone? Okay. I'm like an hour into moving everything out and this is the progress I've made so far. Look at the elevator. Oh my god. The worst part is that I only have 15 minutes left in the moving elevator so I have to get my bed disassembled and my carpet out really quickly. I should have asked someone for, for help, you know, because I'm kind of just doing this by myself and I'm not that strong, believe it or not. noise complaint. Apparently I can't be loud in the elevator area because people are working at a 2 p.m. on a Wednesday. Hey, uh, oh, these woods are so heavy. Why are these so heavy? Ow, I hit my head. Wow. 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 It's all gone. It's so empty, I'm gonna miss this place. Oh my god, the acoustics in here! I'm gonna miss this even more now. It's been about a week and a half and I've tried to be really smart on how I approach moving back into my parents' house without telling them. So what I did is I slowly moved everything from my apartment into my parents' garage over the last week and a half to see if they would notice. And they haven't yet. Like right here, my table, my chairs, that's a dresser. I don't know if you've noticed the couches. Dare I say, I think this will work. If they ask, I'll just say I'm renovating, right? Then they're gonna be like, with what money? And that's gonna be a whole nother issue. I'll just wing it. That's what I usually do anyways, and it seems to work, so. Now it's time to see how long it takes for him to know this. Shouldn't be that long. Today is the second day of living at home without my parents knowing, and tonight I have hockey. The special thing about this is that after hockey, I always go back to my apartment because it's right next to my apartment, so it's easy for me to get there. But today, I'm gonna tell my mom I'm coming back to their place to see how they react and what they say because I've never done that before. Hey mom, I'm going to hockey. Okay, dude, so you're going back to your apartment after? No, I'm actually going to stay here tonight. I'm going to come back. But you always go back to your apartment. Why are you coming back tonight? Yeah, I know, but like, I wanted to change it up for a bit. I, not that I, I couldn't go back, but I just feel like coming back here. Spend more time with you, actually. 
Okay, now you're being weird. How am I being weird? So when are you going back to your apartment? Are you going later in the week or staying mm. here? I think I'm going to stay here this week and then, but yeah, I'll go. That doesn't make sense. You're you paying for your apartment. Why yeah. wouldn't you go there? No, that's a, that is a good point. But I was like, I, I just want to spend more time with you. So I'm, I'm going to stay here and then we're going to go from there. And we'll see where the night takes us, honestly. Why do I believe you? What Why do, you do I think there's something what? going on? What? There's nothing going on. You just are not credible right now. What would make me credible? What does credible mean? <laughs> okay, so funny story. Um, my phone might have died. That's not my fault, though. You know, it could have happened. Anyways, I, I was, uh, that was a fun time. It's now 9.30 p.m. And I scored six goals, seven assists. Kind of went, two fights. I two fights. There's a piece of sweat. Wait, it, it evaporated. Wait. Where's, where's another piece of sweat I can find? Oh! No, that's a hair. There's a piece of sweat. There, do you see it? Do you see it? I worked. I just got home from hockey and showered and turns out my parents are actually asleep right now. It's only 10 p.m. Why are they asleep? Anyways, I thought to myself, they're already gonna be pissed off at me enough for moving back in and not telling them. So I'm gonna let them sleep and have their sleepy time. But tomorrow or the next day or the next week, they're gonna be pissed off. I just need to be stealthy like a ninja getting my food. Tonight, we're gonna make eggs. Mm, it's cracked. I gotta be quiet like a ninja. Ow. It's dripping, it's dripping. I gotta get a pan. Uh, quiet, 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 quiet. Uh, why didn't I just take one from the top? There was one on top I could have just taken. That would have been much quieter. Go out. That didn't feel good. We turn it on high because the hotter it is, the faster it cooks. All great chefs say that. Was trying to get the top for the pan and everything fell. They're definitely awake. They have to be awake after that. Oh, the shell in. There's a shell. Ow! Shell. Ow! Ow! Burn my finger. Boom. Look at that sizzle. Number three. Boom. Bang. People eat raw eggs. How is one side burning and one side's not? Cook. 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 Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Ow, 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 ow. When I took it off, the steam came off, came the water came down off that onto my toe. Just a dab of it. Oh, that's the big end. And let's try her out. So much salt. There's so much salt on that. Um, it's been about a week since I moved out, and today I'm gonna test my parents to see if they realize that I've moved back in with them by telling them I'm going out with some friends to a restaurant that is right beside where my apartment used to be. We'll see if they catch on when I say I have to come back to sleep instead of just staying at my apartment. Dad, I'm going to that Italian restaurant near near where my apartment was, you know, with some friends. So when are you coming home next? Um, well, I'm coming home right after dinner, actually. Not really next time. Have oh. you moved out of your apartment? Why would you say that? All your stuff's in the garage. You've been here a week and you haven't been back to your apartment. So you noticed all that? Yeah, you think I'm stupid? I mean, it took you a week to notice. Is that impressive? I don't know. You're still be you beat mom though. Yeah, I'd live here though again. Just so you know. Aren't you happy? Yeah, I'm thrilled. All right, well, bye. I guess I'll see you tonight. Yeah, okay, bye. Bring me back the pizza. Can I borrow some money? No. Why? It's your dinner. You pay for it. Actually, it's your dinner. You're asking me to bring you back pizza. Yeah, but you live here. It's rent. I'll take and it. you don't pay me. Oh, what? <laughs> well, that's because you never asked. Hey, Mom, I wanted to let you know that I'm not here for dinner tonight. I'm going out with some friends. Okay, where are you going? I don't know. This restaurant that's like downtown near where I live. Oh, yeah, so right you're going to stay there tomorrow night? No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to come back after dinner. How does that make any sense? What do you mean? I wanted to come back. I, I don't do stuff tomorrow morning around here. You've got to be kidding me. You do nothing. You get up in the middle of the afternoon. Yeah, Ma. Uh, uh, don't, uh, don't. First of all, don't expose me. Okay, second of all, I thought you wanted me to mow the lawn. Okay, I can live with that. You come and mow the lawn. Oh, dang it. Okay, yeah, no, I will. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Why?
why do I, oh, I just made myself do more work. We're going to get food now. Oh my God. So don't be mad at me. Yeah. So I didn't want to tell my mom that we're going to get food together because she would think it's a date and stuff and I don't want to give her that idea. Right. Um, so I told her we're going to see a movie. The first movie that came in mind was Barbie. Yeah. So we're going to the Barbie movie. Well, we, we can. Do you want to go to the Barbie movie? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Why Barbie of all movies? Oh, well, what other movie is? Oppenheimer. Why did I just say Oppenheimer? Barbie's kind of cooler. Barbie is cooler, yeah. And Smarter Robbie. Ooh, that's a good point. Yeah, you, you didn't think about Smarter Robbie? No, I didn't. Well, you think, why well, you want to see Barbie then? No reason. Okay. Shawnee's our order at All You Can Eat. What are you ordering? So we're going to start off with Pinot, one of each one. <laughs> no, you're not saying one of each one. <laughs> One of each two. Stop it, no, actually don't. Don't go one of everything. Let's do like seven of these. <laughs> We're gonna do one of everything, boys. We're not doing one of everything. Sam, speak some like... There's no, there's no speaking sense in all. We're gonna eat one of everything. One of everything is better than just getting bulk orders of the stuff we like. It's like Costco. It's like yeah. Costco, buying bulk. <laughs> okay, this is a quarter of what you ordered. This is a quarter of what you ordered. Let's start a <laughs> More food just showed up, more food just showed up. How much did you order? I don't know. You ordered too that's, much. I think that's oh, more's coming. More's coming. Do no fuck off, fuck off. Don't come. Do don't come. Do not come. They ordered. They brought more food. Oh, there's no cheese wontons. Jesus. So. There's <laughs> more. <laughs> no, you ordered more. Yeah, of course. How was your dinner? Dude, I need to go home. <laughs> Why? I need to lie down. Can you eat that much? I need, I, I saw God in there. <laughs> he doesn't have the body for it. Why is the music on? I'm trying to have a good dialogue with Chad here. <laughs> so he's blocking us. He's blocking us in. He's blocking, he's blocking us in. I need to go home. <laughs> All right, bye, dude. Bye, man. <laughs> you have to drive home still. You know that, right? I uh, know. Jesus, take the wheel. Oh, that's not. That's not what you want here. Uh, yeah. Ah, the door. My bad. Alright. All right. Take care. Don't die on the way back. Yeah, Today I up the ante because they aren't getting it. My parents, well, my, my mom, she doesn't know that I've moved back in with them yet, so I have to make it more obvious. I'm gonna tell her that I'm going out with some friends for the entire night and we'll be back home at 3 a.m. Rather than staying right next door at my apartment, I'm gonna come all the way back to their city and stay with them. She's gonna be pissed at this one, but you know what? She's gonna have to deal with it because this is gonna be me all the time with her now. Even though she doesn't know that, but she she will soon. Okay, mom, I'm off. I'm going out tonight. I should be back around 3 a.m. or something. So don't wait up. 3 a.m. You always wake me up when you come in. Why can't you stay at your downtown apartment? Well, yeah, I know it's it is around there. I'll give you that. But I'm just gonna come back home. Okay, here. this is ridiculous. You go to the trouble, you get a downtown yeah. apartment, and then you're you're still here all the time. Like, what's with that? Okay, I hear what you're saying. We're gonna take the level of attitude down a bit, though. All right. <laughs> you want to come home? You better take the level of attitude. I would down. attitude. I'm just. I just want to see you tonight before I go to sleep. At 3 a.m. Yeah. Don't do me any favors. Okay. Well. Yeah. I see. I see what you mean. It could be a little bit annoying, I guess. A little bit. Yeah. We'll see you later then, I guess. Another drink? Dude, I wanna go. I've lost Sam. He just ran away. He's in this alley. Where did he go? What is he doing right now? Sam? Yeah. What are you doing? You get us on camera. <laughs> Mom. <gasps> Mom. What? You're actually back? Yeah. Why? I when you thought I was joking about coming back tonight. I could only hope. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, it means I love you. Okay. Well good night. Good night. Love you. Aww! Really? Will you leave now? Okay. I'm just going to poo in your washroom right back. No! What? Get out of here! Now that I moved back home, I want to renovate my entire room because I'm going to be doing so much more streaming, video editing, and stuff in this room. So it makes sense that this is like an influence room. Right now it's boring. So I got this custom Mac up sign as well as some LED lights to make it really look like an influencer lives here. I texted my mom to say come downstairs is an emergency and I'm going to pretend to be renovating as she comes down. She's going to be pissed. This cost me like a few hundred dollars. That's ridiculous. This is the smallest version too. But there's nothing wrong with small. 
small is sexy. But let me know if you want to see a full video of me renovating my room. Oh my gosh, she's coming. But yeah, let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments. Okay, Matthew. What are you doing? I'm renovating my room. Just trying to hang some new stuff up and stuff. What part of you don't live here anymore do you not understand? No, I understand I don't live here, but when I am here, I want my room to look good at least. What is the point of renovating your room if you're not going to live here? Um, well, Mom, I've been here for the last two and a half weeks. I know, and I don't understand why. Well, when I am here in the future, going forward maybe, um, if you don't have an issue with that. Uh-huh, keep going. Yeah, I, I want my room to be presentable. So, Mac Ups. I'm gonna hang it up and it's gonna say Mac Ups. Just so everyone knows, I'm Mac Ups and this is Mac Ups room. I think there's something going on here that you're not telling me. That's all I got to say. What could be going on here? I think there's something going on here. Took you this long to figure that out? Okay, Matthew, your dad and I need to have a talk with you. You have a place downtown, but you've been here for three weeks. What is going on? Nothing's going on. Why do you think something's going on? Just tell her you moved out. What? You moved out? Thanks, Dad. Wavy, really, thank you. Yeah, really great job. Okay, so you don't have a place downtown anymore. Don't think about it as me moving out. What? Think about it as me moving back in. That's even worse. I don't get why you're angry about this. I'm, I, like, we had all these plans, and now... What plans? Me? Wait. Well, not you, actually. Oh, well, I can be part of them now. No, can't I? Doesn't quite work that way. That would be it. Don't want to know. Do not want to know. So you're telling me you're actually living here again. Don't think about living here again. Think about it as living here still. Eh? And that's eh? supposed to make me feel better about it. Well, that does now know I will. So why did you move back here then? Well, mom, there's a lot of reasons for that. I don't want to get into- You ran out of money? Well, you don't, well, mom, I said there's a lot of reasons. Yes, that might be one of them, but that's not the overarching reason. Well, what would that be? I missed you guys. <laughs> <laughs> you want to live here again. You're paying rent. No. You're doing household chores. No. Tours. Yes. No. And you're getting up before noon. No, no. See, this is why I didn't tell you. It was going so well for the last three weeks. For who? Well, me. Dad, it was going well for you too, right? All good. You were asleep. I have to get bothered. Yep. You guys are a piece of work, both of you. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed. And if you did enjoy, please remember to leave a like, subscribe, and turn on those notifications because I'm going to be coming out with new YouTube videos every single Wednesday and Saturday. I'm still trying to figure out my schedule, but it's it, twice a week. I promise you. I'm going to be uploading twice a week, so please subscribe and let me know what you want to see next. Peace.